Hello everyone, I'm Revolutionary Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here in Old World Blues playing as the Republica Socialista Mexicana, or the Socialist Republic of Mexico as far as I can tell. I don't speak Spanish, but I think that's what it means. But anyways, let's go ahead and let, let's just let time go straight on as we're preparing for a tiny, minor invasion of Nueva Aztlán. And creating some jet bombers as well, you know. Zapata loves his uh, jet bombers. Quite a bit. Cool. Uh, let's see. More range. That ain't bad. It's 2281, which is not bad. Three-dimensional printers. I love the three-dimensional printers. Love them. Cool. Um, Jet bombers. Not too bad, not too bad. We got a lot of... Not a lot, but, you know, a good chunk of political power. Probably won't, still won't be able to go to war economy, but that's okay. Supplies are doing very, very well, of course. Um, like I showed you before, I can't really attach these guys on. Doesn't make any sense, but that's okay. And how much further, or how much longer, will we have to wait till we go to war with these guys? About 40 days. No, not quite ideal, but that's okay. That's kind of okay. Um, let them kill each other off a little bit more. Let's take a good look at the casualties, though. 5,000 versus 9,000. Well, it's not a lot. It's really not a lot of casualties. But I'll take it nonetheless. Keep killing each other, guys. Makes me not have to do all that dirty work. And you know what? How many divisions do they have? We don't have a lot. We have like 53. Yeah. They got a lot more than us. Holy cow. Digital data links. Cool. More decryption. Uh, if that's the case, how about we start making five of these at a time? Do that. Do that. I want more robots. I need more robots. Actually, you know what? Screw it. Let's go up to 10. Because why not? Who cares? Let's go up to 10. Next. Fortifications. Sure. I, I really don't have that much more to spend my political power on. Uh, we're building up more roads, which is nice. I need to research the power station so I can start coring more territory, maybe? Perhaps? It doesn't really matter. That'd be kind of nice. That'd be kind of nice to do. Come on. Come on, Nueva Atzlan. Just give, don't give it up just yet. Just cause as many casualties as you can towards... Chichen Itza. Oh, and we still have our navy here. I was trying to repair a lot of these guys or upgrade them or refit them, I guess the game likes to say. Uh, but the extra ships, well, we got... This is this is too big of a task force. It's way too big. And I'll, I'll cut it down once we have, you know, these guys done. Oh, you're not going to be done for a while. Hold on. Let's just do it like that, then. That's fine with me. Convoys? Am I making any convoys? Maybe not. Triremes. Always good stuff to have. And then... Good. 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 Awesome. Keep making what we're making. We're doing a great job. We Honestly, playing Zapata isn't that difficult. As, as, as long as you know what you're doing. I mean, yeah, Maximilian wasn't easy. Other than that, the Republic of the Rio Grande wasn't too difficult. But I do want to say something here. Like, um, like we see all like the normal map. But if you click on like the undeveloped parts of Texas, like it's called Rub Alcali. Aleppo? I don't think Aleppo's in Texas. I could be wrong, though. There might be an Aleppo, Texas, but I don't think so. And then we have Mosul. There might be a Mosul, Texas in this part of the region, but when you go to the naval screen, it says North Texas. It says Abraxos Corridor, South Texas, Texan Order, bo Texan Border, Three State Corridor, Oklahoma. Oak? Lahoma? Is that. I don't think there's an A in that part of Oklahoma. I think there's only one. Or two A's there. One, two, not three. That's really weird. Oak? I don't know. Hmm. Never noticed that. Has anyone ever noticed that? That's cool. I mean, they said Cuba, Bahamas, South Atlantic Coast, Gulf of Mexico, but... Oak? Lahoma? That's... That's questionable. Not gonna lie. It's a little questionable. Regardless, Nueva Atzlan, thank you for playing. Uh, I greatly appreciate your contribution to your... To Mexico. The people of Mexico don't really thank you, but I thank you anyways. If you guys could go ahead, that would be uh, great. Ooh, Chinese ties, though. Uh, oh, you're uncareful. Yeah, who cares about being careful? Screw careful. Um, can you guys please go? Alright, so you're not going. Alright, I have to manually control you then. So be it. So be it.
Obviously, I'm not going to take that much territory. I don't deserve a lot of it. So, we're almost done with our focus tree. Let's go ahead and do... Unlock, unlock Clock's Garages. Clock left bunkers of pre-war vehicles scattered around his empire. We can access them to equip our forces. I will say one thing about Zapata's focus tree, though. A lot of the descriptions, they're not really in-depth. They're not really, you know, have a big old storyline to them. I mean, there's like a sentence. It's like when I did my Argentina campaign in Road to 56. There's like a sentence or maybe a few sentences that tell you about why we're taking this focus, why we're doing this, why we're doing that. So, I mean, <clears throat> I might would have liked to see maybe a, just a little bit more. And some of the focuses are good. They're actually pretty good. I just would have liked to see seen a, a little bit more, perhaps. Just a little bit more. So, uh, Cool. Um, I'm just going to take whatever I can get and then just give everything else to Chichen Itza. Just a little bit. Just a wee bit. Good enough for me. I'm probably going to take this. I'm going to take that. Um, obviously, Chichen Itza will, will get all of this. And, you know, I'll take one piece, and that's it. Everything else will go to Chichen Itza. Unless... Costa gets something. You know what? I'm just going to give it all to these guys. There you go. I just took a minor amount. Just a minor amount. You know, I, I did, like... 2%, and that's 2%'s worth of land, you know? It make, makes sense. Yeah, 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 totally, totally. I mean, I did take out that territory. You can't even get here, so it's within my lands anyways, and I would have, like, take just, like, a tiny portion of this, just, like, a small portion, but, I don't know. It kind of worked out like this. What casualties did I cause? What are you up to? You guys are over there. We had to prepare for a war with the Chichen Itza now. Obviously, we don't have nearly the amount of divisions they do. They have less manpower, light exemptions. That basically means either go to war with them, or go to war with Kaiser's Legion. I don't want to fight Kaiser's Legion right now, so I'll go to war with these guys. Good luck, robots. But before I go to war, of course, I will make sure we build ourselves up quite a bit before we do anything too crazy. Give me four of you guys. I'm going to need you right there. Oh, they have Mexico City. Very nice. Give me two divisions to go right there. Oh, there's so many waterways. And I definitely don't... Oh, my goodness. I definitely do not have enough divisions to guard the entire front line. But we'll see what happens. Oh, I forgot about using my robots. Not robots. I'm already using robots. I mean my paratroopers. Not my paratroopers. No. My bombers. Something about planes. Something, something, something planes. Let's do that. Um, very nice. Uh, make it two, just because there's like two provinces. I do that. Good. Now we're going to use the infantry for the rest of this, which I really, really don't like doing. That'll be okay, very nice, and the rest of the infantry will guard here. Awesome. Very good, very good. Now, with hopefully enough air support, we'll be okay doing whatever we need to do. Do that. Radar. We could probably get better radar. It's not really good right now, but that's not too bad. You know, Chichen Itza. You know, Socialist Republic of Mexico. Not too bad, not too bad. Maybe I took too much territory. Maybe I did. Maybe I didn't. I don't know. They weren't defending the border, so I just kind of walked in. Mojave Chapter joined the Brotherhood of Steel. Interesting. Interesting developments. And you know what? Actually, you guys, I'm going to start deploying you down here. Just makes more sense. Liniers. Awesome. Awesome. Cool. Planes. You can come down here. Oh, we got a big old stack we can put on here. Ooh, Mark 1's nice. Um, go down by 50, and then go back up. There you go. Actually, you know what? Just go up to 200. Better radar. Nice. That's exactly what I wanted. Build, build. And then build over there, because we don't have any radar on this side of Mexico. Plane's looking pretty good. Pretty good. Awesome. Go to train. Not really using you for anything, so go ahead and train. Ah, there goes the Shoshone Nation. Very nice, very nice. And we're going to produce at least a few more robot divisions before we do anything else. 
I notice that Kaisar, well, he doesn't like me. And he's got a lot of divisions stationed around there. That makes me at least a wee bit uncomfortable. Just a little bit. So the faster I can take out Chichen Itza and her allies, the better for everyone. Um, they don't have a lot of manpower, which is actually really good to see. We have a ton of manpower. Holy cow. Better robots? Not yet. You know what? Screw it. Make 16. Make more. I need more, 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 more. Uh, energy cells? Sure, because why not? Uh, digital decryption? Very good. Let's get some encryption. Kaiser, what are you up to? Expand the Via Militaris. They have a little bit of manpower. 167 divisions. They have a lot of population. We've unlocked Tlaloc's garage. We can take to the skies, though. With Tlaloc gone, it's time for us to reclaim the skies from the upstart humans. Pesky humans. Pesky, pesky, pesky. And you know what? I'm going to take a claim state. Just so that we start doing that now instead of later. Awesome. We got some more dockyards. Can I upgrade my longboats? No, I don't think I can. I haven't really developed too much else. Triremes, perhaps. No. 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 And then you know what else I'm going to say? Probably not. Oh, but we have this. Do that. That's better. Nice. I didn't realize that. Cool. Uh, we already have enough boats, so I don't really mind doing that. Cool. Awesome. And I guess throw on... Oh, we already have a thing of convoys. Uh, sure. I'm probably actually going to lose a lot of my ships whenever I go to war with anybody. So, it doesn't really matter. You guys are all done refitting. Awesome. You guys can come over here. And do that. Uh, let's see. Take half of you. Make a new group. Take half of you. And then make a new group. Um, That's not exactly ideal. Select to you. Select half of you. Make a new group. That's not bad. Actually, that's not really good, though. Yeah. Uh, 16, that might be a little bit too many. Give me 8. Throw you right there. Uh, maybe not. Maybe that was too much. Yeah. Whoops. Wrong group. Wrong group. And let me double check. It's not bad. Right there. Perfect. Cement concrete. Cool. Uh, more monthly population, sure. Just let's let time go on. Let's... Make sure we can at least produce some of these guys. That's going to be very important. Guardia, can we throw anything else on here? Maintenance companies for more reliability. More HP, as it isn't bad. Slightly less organization. Equipment capture ratio. I should make some fire teams. Logistic companies? Maybe. They do. It doesn't give us more HP, which means they have more... They don't technically... Technically, it's not necessarily strength, but it takes less time for them to get killed off. Even though their supplies are already pretty good. Ooh, it looks like we just might have made another three divisions. Awesome. I'll let them go to wherever they need to be. There goes them. There goes... Oh, another five? Yes, please. Good. Space yourselves out. Um, I'm probably going to need an army group around here. Depending on how many bombers I have. Ooh, or maybe not. Maybe, maybe not. Good. Let you guys come right there. Four task forces. That's not bad. You're all stationed right here, so do the left side for now as well. Since we have two... Okay, good, good, yes, yes, Kaiser, please, don't fight me. Fight those metal tin men. The Siege of Hidden Valley has ended. That was fast. Holy cow, that was fast. Um, do that. Resource efficiency gain, because why not? Kaiser is looking pretty formidable. Hidden Valley, wow, that was... Yeah, that was really, really, really fast. Um, take to the skies, very good. I want to watch them die first. Mm. And I do have ah uh, no manpower that sucks for them. Some of my neo anarcho zapatismo coffee from our cooperatives here. Nice. Let's go and do the heroes of the revolution, the first revolution. Mexico's first revolution was led by people who dreamed of a better Mexico. It included not just heroes like Zapata, but artists who dreamed of a better tomorrow, like Diego Rivera and Frida Kahlo. Let us embrace. Their heritage, yes. Not our heritage, but their heritage, which, which will become our heritage. Let's see. You know what? I never use art bots. Let's use them. I never, never, never use them. I never use them. But let's be a little different, and I'll try them out. Once we have at least a few more divisions. Now, actually, that's, that's really good. That, um, Kaiser, good, good. Just go to war with the Brotherhoods, if you can. You're not... Oh, good. Pretty nice. Actually, are you at war with the... 
<clears throat> Western Brotherhood? Oh, you are. Scorpions, please get in a fight with somebody, please. For the love of God, please. Uh, can I justify on you? Oh, I can't. I don't want to piss him off, though. It only takes 20 days. Eh, we'll just piss him off anyways, because why not? And before we're done, we shall go to war with our bombers. Um, you guys do that. I want half of you guys to come here. The other half will stay here. They're probably going to attack me over the river, river first. Probably. So I just want to be prepared for that. Good. You guys all have orders. Make sure that all the planes have orders because that's kind of important. Do that. And then you guys. Nice. Rotary engine bombers. Mark 1. They just have a little bit more reliability, that's all they have. Cool, it's 2282 now, which is a very good year, very good year. Uh, oh, they don't seem really strong in some of these divisions. Oh, they have a lot of anti-tank, that's not ideal. Um, well, they might have a lot. Not everyone has anti-tank, though. And we do have quite an air force, so let's see what happens. We're at war with, we will be at war with three nations. They, oh, then they're a part of the Jungle Pact. And they immediately declare war on me. And they're winning in some places, and they're not winning in some other places. It's pretty much what I kind of expected. Ah, oh, very good. Oh, we, we have another army now. Great. Um, So far, I think we're winning. We're doing pretty darn well. I'm going to put you down here so that I can move these three divisions out of the way. New general, new general, new us, new general. Horace MacArthur. Hello, Horace. I hope you like your new position. You three, though... We'll come join. It doesn't really matter. Join. You come up here. That's fine with me. Since we have you guys now, a better radar. How about we get even better radar? I like that idea. Better, better, and then even better. Oh, well, what are we doing in the waters? You know, this is the first time I've actually probably seen the Chichen Itzen really use their navy. At least against me. Usually, I don't see them using their navy too much whenever I go to war with them. But I'm glad to see there's a little bit of a change. And they're using convoys. Oh, radioactive storm. Or rate. Oh, there you go. There you go. They did the big no. The big naval invasion. Or the NI. Ah, uh, bye bye. It might be a good idea to keep some forces in reserve. Yeah, I didn't think they would be able to pierce me. Or. Well, they can probably pierce me, but can't really push me out. So that's kind of ideal. Uh, robot stuff. Breakthrough? I love the breakthrough. I live for the breakthrough. Ooh, don't forget. Can we go to... Yes, finally. It only took us like seven years, but now we can go to war economy. We're continuing to build up more radar. That's nice. We really don't need to build up that much more stuff. I mean, I want more jet bombers. Yeah, I want more sentry bots, but all this stuff, it's nice. I should research some heavy machine guns, because why not? What are the casualties like so far? We've lost 92 versus 8,000. Not bad. Not bad. Pretty good. I, I tell you, that's, that's uh, pretty good. And I'm joined here with my revolutionary cat. Binky. You okay? Yeah, do you want to get rid of the Chichen Itza too? Of course. And who are they led by? I believe I told them to be led by Kalumte, but they're actually led by Guzman right now. Tehun Guzman. So, we'll see what happens. They have a lot of... How many ships do they have? I didn't look that. 133, but they're usually just sending just convoys. Digital encryption. Very nice. Uh, let's get some support stuff. Uh, saws? Sure. I don't... Honestly, I don't use a lot of saws. But, you know, we'll use them because we can. Beautiful. Cool. Keep making those divisions. You know what? Train even more Coast Guards because we can. Make 10 because we actually need a lot. I, I lied. Make 12. And we shall finish with destroy the Vice Royalty, which was the first nation we took out... At the very beginning of our campaign, ghoul slavers and pirates are simply not compatible with the workers' utopia Zapata is building. But, you know, he can remove them with one simple trick. By making, though, making them go kapoom. Awesome. Not bad. Uh, does anyone have upgrades yet? Chester, no, but you're doing alright yourself. No. Horace MacArthur, you're just kind of fresh. You're new. Ah, uh, gotta love that Hoi4 AI. They just keep railing themselves into me. Ah, oh, they're using ghoul. I, whenever I was playing as a... Oh, wait, no. These is Costa Cafenadas. Yeah, I never used the ghouls before. So have a little bit of manpower. What do they have for spirits? Daily political power? 
last year's harvest, economic refugees. Generals in abundance. Hmm. Ah, awake and angry. Ooh, dirt frame eyeballs. Nice. I never use them. I'll have to get that. Let's see if I can uh, use them now. Mr. Gutsies, it's outdated. It's 8 breakthrough, 16 and a half soft attack. iBots have 10 breakthrough and 19.8. That's good enough for me. And actually, these Mr. Gutsies, they take 0.2, and iBots, of course, use 0.2 as well. Awesome. Actually, can I upgrade them? No, that's disappointing. I would love to upgrade them. I would love to. Now, with the. Oh. Um. Right under your line, man. Oh, nonetheless, let's start pushing this way. I'm not going to push with everyone else just yet, especially the infantry. They're, the enemies are pretty, actually, kind of pretty injured, actually. That's kind of good to see. You guys, instead of focusing there, focus down south. Actually, you guys come here and focus south. You guys, you're doing okay for now. Um, you know what? Let you guys focus down here while we deploy another 50 planes. They're not the best planes, but, you know, whatever. Do that area, too. Cool. Awesome. Good job, guys. Good job. More robots? Uh, I think so. I think so. You know what? Let you guys go on, too. And you know what? Not you guys yet. We're not really ready to move from our position here just yet, but you're a panzer expert. Thomas Jenkins. Very nice. Very nice. Uh, how many divisions are here? Cool. That's it. Alright. Now it's your turn to move. Let all the robots move before I send the infantry in to move because they are the squishiest robot extraction oh even more robots i love it we'll need them against kaiser oh kaiser oh let's get some uh power stations we might need those for coring more stuff if we choose to do so even though we really have a ton of manpower already and go right ahead infantry you are last but probably the least to be honest with you and that's okay with me losses thus far 121 versus 19,000. Not bad. Not bad whatsoever. Yeah, there's a lot of battles going on here, so let's make sure we keep them up to strength. Keep them down here so we can reach the areas a little bit faster. That's great. We're doing a great job. we got a few more factories that I don't really need. Um, even more advanced cooling systems. Great Sentry Bot Mark IIs are a little bit ahead of time. Oh, common energy weapons. I forgot about you. Um... Go ahead and put them out of their misery. Put them out of their misery. Very good, very good. Uh, Division-wise, how are they doing? Horace MacArthur falls ill. Well, you, I just hired you. Why are you ill? They have 163 divisions. We have makeshift squad automatic weapons. We've destroyed the vice royalty. I'm surprised they didn't just kind of go past that. Um, I forget which one I ever I choose. Mini guns? Well, let's get a Tesla cannon just because we're, we're kind of an advanced nation. So that sounds kind of fun. Uh, select national focus. I could get more political power, but that really means nothing to me. Robot production. I already have enough robots. What else we have here with this mod compilation that I have on? Factory construction boost. Ooh. Recruitable population. Recruitable population growth. We already get 302 a month. That's not a ton. More resources. Energy cell gain. Per energy. I, you know me. You know me. If you've been following my channel, you know I love construction engineering. You know I love it. That's great. I love it. Just keep building, building, building. When we're done building, build some more. Build, like, walls or something. Uh, build one that up there. I don't really care. Uh, airports, air bases, good, good, good. Infrastructure is looking great so far. Now, usually, when I try to take out Mexico, I will complain almost every single time about the waterways. But by starting in the middle of Mexico, it's not nearly as bad. It's still not ideal. But it's not nearly as bad. Holy cow, we should probably fix this up just a wee bit. There you go. That's a little bit better. Three hundred one factories. Not bad. Pretty good. Pretty good. Um, I mean, it's just... With them using infantry versus my robots, and sometimes they can pierce me, but sometimes they can't. It's very nice. It's very nice. You guys come over here. Good. And help out down here. You guys, 200. Do we have another airbase around here? Yes, we do. Thank you. Go ahead and start doing that area. Again, they would probably need a little bit of help. Uh, you guys, move on further down south to... Well, it's not that far, much further south. 
Gotta love the range on these bombers, though. Gotta love it. Ah, another infantry division. Good, good. More robots? I think so. Yeah, seriously. How many divisions do they have now? We've killed off seven more. Pretty nice. We've caused 37,000 casualties. We've lost 260. Ah, oh, I love playing so much. Demand... They're dead, guys. They're dead. We can't demand stuff from the dead. Well, I guess technically we could, but we would get nothing out of it. Oh, hold on, hold on. There's a battle. We're going to lose some con some light cruisers, probably. We've sunk one. Come on, battle cruisers. Get in there. Get in there. No. I wanted to see a bigger battle. Oh, we sunk another one. Oh, we sunk quite a few. Oh, don't lose it. Oh, we lost one. We lost two. We sunk eight destroyers. That's kind of nice, though. Um, if that's the case, I want you all to go ahead and just repair. Let you all repair. Not everyone's going to need repairs, and that's good. Um... Oh, that's so close to being a pretty good task force. So close. And repairs for our ships? Bring that up. That's good. They're all moving. They're trying to get to the good dockyards. Or at least dockyards. Not, maybe they're not good. At least get to dockyards. Ooh, Salas, yes. Very awesome. Better radar. Even better radar. How about even better radar? When in doubt, make even better radar. Do that. Do that. Do that. Because who cares? Um, do that. And, you know what, do it, why not? Because, why not? Screw it, let's do it. Oh, wow, we're doing extremely well. Uh, we only have, like, a few divisions here. Hey, Binky, back? Yeah? Sit on the chair. Sit on the chair. Take a nap. That's right. That's right. Cool. Get rid of these guys. They don't really deserve to be here. Well, not really after we killed off most of the divisions anyways. Good. Oh, six. Oh, wow. We have a full army of from horse. And he isn't even level two yet. Beautiful. Awesome. And they're dead. Good, good, good. You guys come here. Take them out when you can. Infantry. You're doing a great job so far, too. Um, come down here. And do like that. Now, let's go back to the planes. I hate manually con controlling them. Sometimes. In the early game, it's not too bad, but by this time in the game, I would love to just be able to plop them on each army. That's such a nice addition to have. You guys... There's not a lot of air bases actually around here. Organic processors, the Sultrons, because why not? That'd be good. Guerrero. High capacity rap... No, what was that? High capacity... High ra heavy rapid capacitor weapon. Soft attack, piercing, eh, let's get some more soft attack. Next up, some of these bad boys. Thank you very much, thank you very much. I just started making... Wow, we actually have a lot of those, holy cow. Uh, Guardia. Hope you're having a good day. Fire teams, because... Why not? I might just make them 40 combat with, actually. That might be a little bit more fun. Alright, so you guys, we gotta concentrate you guys just a little bit better here. You're a little bit too spread out for my liking. Pancho Villa, you are very good. Level 7. He's wounded, though. You guys are down there. Um, please just go on in. Thank you very much. Good. Now I can actually send you guys down here. Which, to help cover what Zapata was doing. You infantry are down a little bit further to the west. And you guys are just kind of hanging out. I don't want you guys just to hang out. I want you to get jobs done. Very beautiful, Horace. Very good job. Um, you know what? How about Zapata up here? Zapata? No. How about Pancho Villa? Pancho Villa. Keep doing what you're doing, guys. Great job. Um, there are really not that many air bases around here. How about down here for now? Yeah, we have we have an airbase coming along there. With this for now, go ahead and come up to the north. Big Ben country, huh? And then send... Do we have any other planes? Eh, not too many more. Cool. Comet energy weapons. Sure, we'll build more of that, even though we're not releasing really it at the moment. Uh, recovery rate. Cool. Uh, look at a lot of this infrastructure is already just so good. Uh, for some reason, I can't click on it to produce it first, but that's okay. Very nice. And we have another army being produced. 
Thomas Farnsworth. Hmm, Farnsworth. That sounds a little familiar. No one else has upgrades. That's totally fine. Unpause and... What do we have? Basic laser weaponry for common energy weaponry. Alright. Next up. Well, we've lost about 300. We've killed about 62,000. Robots are... Sometimes not too... Too difficult to use. They're actually sometimes really, really easy. Oh, seven more divisions? Sure, throw you up top. Because Kaiser needs to get a spanking. Well, maybe spanking wasn't the right word there, but... Whatever, you know. You know what I mean. Mm, what are you guys up to? I really hate using infantry to go crazy. But seeing as the enemies are quite literally getting overran now, not really too worried about it. Oh, goodness. 81,000 have died. Holy cow. Oh, oh my goodness. We actually need a lot of combat robots. I didn't realize that. Cool. So, everyone else, you can probably come down here. That's okay. That's okay. Just make a lot of combat robots. We're going to need them. They've been, they've been doing an extremely great job, so really not too worried about that. Chichen Itza. 46 divisions. Less than a, a 100 than they started with. They started with like 150-some. That's awesome. We will need just a wee bit of time to uh, prepare ourselves to get a surplus of combat robots going. But it's interesting to see the dead horses and Grand Tribes have the same green color. Very odd. Very, very odd. Um, infantry, I guess we can come down here. That'd be fine with me, you guys. You've done a great job, but just keep doing what you're doing. <laughs> great. I mean, they're still putting up some sort of defense, which makes sense. But, uh... Heat resistance lasers, they're, they're still... Oh, they actually raise their conscription level to minimal exemptions. Heat resistant lasers. Gatling guns? Gatling lasers, really. That sounds like fun. God, imagine if I owned one. That'd be weird. That'd be cool, but weird. A lot of divisions. 47 Coast Guard divisions. Well, we're going to need a lot more Coast Guards by the time we're done here. Basically, I would say at least 60% of Mexico has to be coast. Has some sort of coastline, including rivers. River banks. So, at least 60, if not like 70%. So much. Actually, almost every single tile has some sort of coast. Oof. Uh, I know I got some extra divisions I could deploy. Give me just a moment here. I'm just doing this for future's reference. We need like 120 uh, coast guards. That's a lot. That's a lot of coast guards. That's okay though. Nice. Oh, of course, a lot of this, a lot of the time, um, the deficit is somewhat caused by the new divisions we want to make so that makes that actually makes more sense uh, minus 820 not bad not bad everything else is looking pretty good we probably don't have a lot of air support right now because we're pretty far away from where we were at you guys come down here how about in how about in Campeche? Campeche? cool you guys come on down here you really don't have the range for what you need to do so i'm going to send you back up north um 50 250 good Good, Mr. Mocha Lover. Revolutionary Mocha Lover. Keep thinking about the future. The vehicles. Not bad. Missile launchers. Grenade machine guns. I have to do that. I love grenade machine guns. And how many divisions do they have left? 24. They started with like 150, 160 some. And we've so far lost less than 1,000. I, I, I'll be honest. I'm feeling pretty good about this war. Pretty good. Usually I complain about Mexico a lot more. So I'm feeling pretty good about this, actually. Not bad. Uh, ships, how are you doing? Oh, some of you guys are... Oh, I lost a few ships. Why don't you do your battle cruisers? This is really not an ideal naval composition. Or task force composition. But, uh... That's okay. Yeah, that's really not good, but I don't really care. Good enough for me. Which I hope is good enough for you as well. But if not, oh well. Uh, ooh, even more. Good. How many ships have, have I lost? I don't like it because we can't see. I don't like Old World Blues because you can't see how many ships you lost. I lost five. I've killed almost 700, but we lost five. Five too many, in my opinion. Uh, and Chichen Itza is like 70% of the way towards capitulation. That's nice. Grab some more of that. Even 
better radar. You know what's even better than better radar? Even better, better radar. Missile launchers? Sure. Gatling lasers, thank you. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Oh, and don't forget, infrastructure. It must be built. Now, like I said at the beginning of this campaign, my goal is to unite all of Mexico. I don't want to take out over all the waste. I've done that at the time of this recording too recently. I don't want to do that, so I won't do that, but I do want all of what is properly Mexican territory before the Great War. So, just to let you know. Go do that, because why not? Mm. Pancho Villa, a great general. He's level 8. Level 8 general. Awesome. He just became level 8. I doubt anyone else really has other upgrades. Actually, a lot of you guys aren't even doing anything because you've done really, really well so far. You guys come up there. Robots. I know supply sucks. I know it does. Just go ahead anyways. And infantry, I'll help you out in just a wee bit. Even more robots. Good. Almost an entire another army. And send half of you guys here so the supply doesn't eat up your robots. Ah, beautiful. Oh, are you guys not doing anything? Like, I'd recommend just, just get the capital, perhaps, maybe? Nice. That army's fully done. Great. Great. Now hold, everyone. Do what you need to do. When you get... We took Chichen Itza. And they're about to capitulate. Awesome. Beautiful. Beautiful. Let's go ahead and send some of these planes up north. Because we really don't need them in the south anymore. Up there to Texas. Good old Texas. You guys, go ahead and train. Uh, I know a lot of these guys actually don't need to, but I, I like a lot of air XP. Ooh, we don't have a lot of spare planes, though. Hmm. Seems like we need more repairs. Oh, we're not even making any because we have a lot of factories to repair. Good, we took that. That should be enough. There you go. Ah, oh, beautiful. Isn't that just beautiful, guys? I think so. Look at that. Just look at it. Come on. I know it's a lot to... There you go. Look at that. Mexico is almost completely united. But that's all the time for that we have today. But I want to let you know, tomorrow might be the end of the campaign, depending on how fast we can take out Kaisar's Legion. They are doing the new thesis. They have a little bit of manpower. They have a ton of divisions, but we didn't have a ton of divisions when we took out Chichen Itza, but look at us now. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, maybe leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I will see you all tomorrow as we will go to war with Kaisar and maybe even the Scorpions and, of course, the Tohono Nation. Thanks for watching, guys, and hope you have a great, great rest of your day.